Steve Hancha. I'm Vice President of Manufacturing for Huntsman Advanced Materials. We make advanced epoxy solutions for customers all over the world. Uh, we're here today in Kingsport, Tennessee at the Palace Business Excellence Institute um, with a team of uh, three other guys from my organization. We're learning a lot about some of the business excellence things that Palace has put into place over the last 30 years. Uh, it's very exciting for us. We're a, a manufacturing organization, not a restaurant organization. But a lot of the things along training, process, people expectations, it, it applies very well to us. And we're just looking for a way to, to get better at what we do. Uh, there's been a lot of highlights. I mean, just, you know, it, it, one of my favorites that we've gotten is inspect what you expect. And so I, I think sometimes we've gotten away from some of the real basics of understanding what it is that we're asking people to do and spending a lot of time making sure that things are done the way we expect them to be done each and every time. If we do that, then the tough things will get done much more efficiently. Okay, if we do the easy stuff better, more consistently all the time, our end product's gonna be a better solution for our customers. There's been a lot of restaurant stories that have gone through this, but this is not a restaurant story. This is a business excellence story. This is a story of manufacturing excellence. It's a story of how do, I, how do I get the most customer loyalty out of the things that I do each and every day? How do I work with my team to enhance that customer loyalty? That goes above and beyond the restaurant industry, the chemical industry. I think the application is here for anyone who wants to learn how to do what they're doing better, how to do a better job of, of getting customer excellence, customer loyalty. I don't know that I've learned anything new over the last two days, but it's crystallized a lot of the things that I've known. Quite, a fr quite frankly, a couple of times it's, it's challenged me in ways that, okay, I know this, but why am I not going out to my sites making sure that we do this consistently on a regular basis? Why is it that I'm accepting less than what we as an organization can do? And then if I don't expect that, how do I expect the people that work for me to expect that? How do I expect the people on the floor to deliver that? So it, enlightening, embarrassing once in a while, but it, it's an opportunity for us to get better. Mm -hmm.